Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. What a wonderful So today's video is going to be my body care collection and running through that for you guys. I think this is honestly the most body care I've ever had. It's so much, so it barely fit on my bed, honestly. Um, if you go back, I'll put the like playlist of all my collection videos. If you go back, you can definitely tell that my collection has grown a lot. So we have a lot of work to do to get through this stuff, but I'm just gonna run through it with you guys. This will probably be a longer video because you can see that's like so much stuff behind me, but I hope you enjoy it. Grab a snack, grab a beverage, and let's get started. Okay, here is just a general overview. I tried to organize this, but you guys, it was honestly very hard to organize. So I did my best. I have all my lotions down here, shower gels. I've got the moisturizing body wash the body creams, some perfumes are all down here, minis in this corner, all of my sprays, made it to two rows, all of my body scrubs, body oils, body butters, hand soaps, and then like miscellaneous stuff. So let's get started. Okay, so starting down at the bottom with lotions, these are two that I am currently using, and that is Beach Nights and Coco Paradise. Then I have some signature scents. I have Twilight Woods and In the Stars. And then we've got some fall items, Pumpkin Cupcake, Champagne Apple and Honey, White Pumpkin and Chai, and Midnight Amber Glow. And then these two winter body lotions in Twisted Peppermint and Iced Sugar Plum. And then going up to shower gels, I have two beach nights. I'm currently using one. I have Cocoa Paradise, Fresh Coconut and Cotton, Among the Clouds, a Life of the Party, the Fall Fragrances in Midnight Amber Glow, Sweater Weather, Champagne Apple and Honey, Pumpkin Pecan Waffles, and Vanilla Mocha Cream, and then just one, I guess you could consider Vanilla Mocha Cream a winter fragrance, but I also have Iced Sugar Plum, and then these two that are not Bath & Body Works, I have the Philosophy Strawberry Guava Coconut, and the I Heart Revolution Shower Shake in Vegan Mint Chocolate. Going up to my moisturizing body washes, I have this Pacifica Island Vanilla Body Wash. I actually just received a PR package from Pacifica uh, because of Instagram, so thank you so much Pacifica for sending that my way. It was gifted, and yeah, so I'm excited to try that one out. And then I've got four of the moisturizing ones from Bath & Body Works, Sunshine Mimosa, which I'm using right now, Into the Night, In the Stars, and Midnight Amber Glow. I've got five body creams, Pink Chiffon, Fresh Coconut and Cotton, Whipped Coconut Milkshake, and two in Midnight Amber Glow. And then we will go down to these perfumes over here. So like I said, I just got in a bunch of Pacifica stuff. So I have these four perfumes that I haven't even opened yet. I have sniffed them, but I'm not like currently using them. So I have Sunrise Moon, which is Peach, Cardamom, and Mandarin. Neon Moon, which is Sandalwood, Jasmine, and Smoky Cardamom. This one's going to be really good for fall. Dream Moon, which is Patchouli, Sandalwood, and Pink Rose, and then Island Vanilla. And then I have a full-size Bath & Body Works Champagne Toast Perfume, and two from Dossier, one in Floriental Brown Sugar, and one in Musky Musk. I've got these four little uh, roller balls slash spray mini perfumes. I have Sunshine Mimosa from Bath & Body Works, Skylar Vanilla Sky. This is such a wonderful vanilla scent. I'm currently using it. We've got Into the Night and Midnight Amber Glow. And then for some mini perfumes, I did pick up this replica set of all of their perfumes um, a few months ago, I think, during the Sephora sale. So it comes with Jazz Club, Lazy Sunday Morning, Under the Lemon Tree, By the Fireplace, Bubble Bath, Autumn Vibes, Coffee Break, Sailing Day, Beach Walk, and Springtime in a Park. So I do have these two that I'm currently using in my project Use It Up, and that is sailing what is it sailing day and beach walk and besides those i have this glass rose mini perfume from mix bar i have two chanel chances you get these if you go shop at nordstrom like they give you a lot of samples so i have that i also have coco from chanel and then i have this extra replica by the fireplace that did not come in here it came um, i believe as a mini sample from sephora and then I also have this Tom Ford Ebony Fume perfume. This is definitely more of like a unisex perfume. I've got these four little minis from Ariana Grande. I believe this one is Sweet Like Candy. Um, this one is Moonlight. 
This one is Sweet Like Candy Intense, and I cannot remember for the life of me what this one is. But yeah, those are all Ariana Grande. And then right here is just kind of like my minis area. So I've got these little shower gels. This is a Scentsy Body Wash in Vanilla Waves, a Pure Wonder, and then just a random Olay one. I've got four of these little hand creams, In the Stars, Happy Easter Tutti Fruity Candy, Strawberry Pound Cake, and White Coconut Caramel. And then I do have this Burt's Bees little goat's milk hand cream. I have these sprays in the minis. I have Happy Halloween Vampire Blood from last year. I got Champagne Apple and Honey, Warm Vanilla Sugar, two Midnight Amber Glows, and one Victoria's Secret Bear. And then I do have this little set from Sol de Janeiro in Coco Cabana. They have the cream, the uh, moisturizing shower, what is it called? Body cream cleanser, and then the spray. I have Champagne Apple and Honey in the body cream, Aveeno Daily Moisturizing Body Lotion, the Mary Kay Wildberry and Passionflower hand cream, and then this one from Pacifica. This is the Vegan Collagen hand cream. I'll just go ahead and do my scrubs since we're already right here. I have this one from Dove. This is the Brown Sugar and Coconut Butter. I'm so excited to start using this one. Um, I have not tried it yet, but I'm really excited. I've got this one from Tree Hut and Velvet Coffee, and then I'm currently using this Trader Joe's Brazil Nut Body Scrub. I've got some from Bath & Body Works. So I have this marshmallow pumpkin latte. It's actually broken up here. The seal broke at the top of the packaging. So I have to keep it upright or else it'll leak. I have Gingham Vibrant in the Foaming Sugar Scrub. Pure Wonder in the Exfoliating Glow Body Scrub. I'm using this one right now too. I've got this Dionys Goat Milk Whip Body Scrub in Vanilla Bean. And then a new Pacifica Island Vanilla Body Scrub. I've got a few little oils here. So this is the L'Occitane Shower Oil. Um, this one is a really unique formula. It's a like luxurious foaming shower oil. It's basically like a moisturizing shower gel. So it's really fun. I only got the mini um, about a month ago or maybe two months ago. And it's really fun to use. I have this new Pacifica Vegan Collagen Body Oil and then my Bath & Body Works Aromatherapy Stress Relief. And then I do only have two of these body butters. I have Mina Amber Glow. This is a Glotion body butter, so it is glowing. And then this Trader Joe's Brazil Nut body butter, which I'm currently using. And I absolutely adore this stuff. I'm about halfway through. Since we're up here, I'll just go ahead and go through the hand soaps that I have. I don't have too many. Um, I did not include the ones that I'm currently using, so this is just like my back stock. So I have White Tea and Sage and Pineapple Mango that I just picked up in the Blends collection. I have a Radiant Sky, Strawberry Pound Cake, and then a couple for fall, White Coconut Caramel and Toasted Butterscotch Latte, and then a Mahogany Teakwood. This one is for Ryan to use. Okay, I'm kind of holding the phone upside down backwards, so I hope this isn't too crazy for you guys, but here's all my sprays. So I have Fresh Coconut and Cotton, Beach Nights, Mint Chocolate Swirl, Strawberry Pound Cake, and then these are kind of like year-round scents, Warm Vanilla Sugar, Velvet Sugar, Twinkling Nights, Almond Blossom, and this Twilight Woods Shimmer Spray. I've got three from Sol de Janeiro. I have Brazilian Crush 40, 71, and 62. This one I am currently using and loving. And then I have two from Victoria's Secret Pink. This is from one of their uh, winter collections. This is Whip Dream and Vanilla Swirl. And then up here we have Fall and Winter. So we have White Pumpkin and Chai, one of my favorites, Bonfire Bash, Vanilla Mocha Cafe, which is just vanilla mocha cream. And then Blush Cardigan and Wrapped in Vanilla. These two came in a collection together last year. I have my beloved Frosted Wonderland from like 2014. I will never go through this. This is like my collector's edition, I like to say. So I'll never use that one up, but I have that one. I have Ice Sugar Plum. And then from this collection, I believe in 2020, Coconut Mint Drop, Vanilla Bean Noel, and Christmas Cookies. And then up here, I just wanted to show you my little pocket back collection. It's not very big, but I have Winter Candy Apple Frozen Lake, two Toasted Vanilla Chais, which is one of my favorite scents in the pocket back. I have a white t-shirt, an Into the Night, and a raspberry, what is this? Raspberry Jam. And then my little pocket back holders, which I just wanted to show you guys because they're super cute. So I have two um, little like fall ones, fall slash Halloween, a little ghosty and a little pumpkin spice latte. And then a couple from winter, this little gingerbread guy and the little polar bear with a little scarf. She's so cute. And the last thing I have to show you guys are these two little, I guess like both bath fizzies. This is Mary Cookie um, from a few years ago. 
in the little mini bath fizzies. I don't actually own a bathtub in my current apartment, so these won't get used, but they're super cute, and I remember they smelled good. And then I have this Aromatherapy Eucalyptus Spearmint um, Shower Steamers. I actually really like this um, formula. It's pretty cool. So yeah, that's those. So I'm gonna run through some numbers for you guys. Um, I'm just gonna count out each category in my collection and tell you the number and I'll also show you the number that I had in my last collection video that I did I believe in January so let's go through that so for body lotions I have two four six eight ten body lotions right now in the end of June of 2023 I have two four six eight ten twelve fourteen shower gels right now I have one, two, three, four, five moisturizing body washes, and I have five body creams. For perfumes, I'm not sure that I counted them last time, including minis, so we'll just count all of them. 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. 31. Lots of perfumes here, guys. I have four hand lotions. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, Body care minis, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight sh uh, body scrubs, one, two, three body oils, two body butters, six hand soaps. I think I actually forgot to count these in the beginning of the year, but I have seven pocket backs, four, so I have 24 fine fragrance mists. So as you can tell, I definitely have a lot of stuff and I definitely have over a hundred items, I would say. I'll put up the final number here. I just, I couldn't count that much right now. But yeah, I have a lot of body care items. I have a lot that I need to get through. And I actually have a lot of duplicates that I didn't realize that I had now that I'm putting everything out here. But I have a lot of body care that I bought specifically at Winter SAS to save for fall. So I have a lot of stuff that I bought I basically have enough for fall that I don't need to buy anything. And of course, I'm going to want to buy stuff. So yeah, I need to do an inventory on that of exactly how much fall stuff I will have. Um, because I just need to keep in mind that I don't need to buy a lot for the fall if I already have body care. So yeah, I definitely bought a lot this year. And I didn't stick to my current rule, which is like two out, one in. Which basically means if I use up two products, I can buy a new product. So I really should stick to that. Um... I think for the rest of the year to get my collection back down to where I'm comfortable, which would be uh, maybe only two thirds of the bed. That would be great. <laughs> so yeah, um, definitely need to watch my collection. I think in every category, I need to decrease it by a lot. So that's where I'm at currently. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing a look into my body care collection. Let me know down below if you are where you want to be with your body care collection or if you have too much or too little um to some people my collection might actually be small which is totally fine if you like to have a lot of um variety that's great um you do you but for me that's a little too much and i know for some people this is probably way too much so i don't need judgmental comments please i do a lot of reviews on youtube this is one of my passions is body care smelling good having fun things to use so you know everybody spends money on what they like and this is what I choose to spend my money on. So please refrain from any mean or rude comments. I will just delete them. So anyways, thank you so, so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.